All right, here we have probably one of my biggest childhood fans. And it's the actual fan from my childhood. So, yeah, this is a kind of a special fan to me. Um, this is a Lakewood T99 window fan. Twin window fan at that. Um, the backstory behind this is this used to uh, be used in my grandma's house. In the living room window every summer up until she got the air conditioner put in. And when that happened, the fan got put in the basement and kind of forgotten about. Until I started collecting fans again. And I asked my grandma about it. And she gave it to me. And it's been in my collection ever since. Um, but yeah, I remember this fan very well. Used to run in the window all the time. And I always wanted this fan. When I was a kid, I was like, I'm going to get that fan one day. And, well, now I have it. Um, but, yeah, this is a 9-inch twin window fan. Um, oddly enough, these blades are very similar to a 9-inch Lasco blade. Which is very strange. I actually probably have a 9-inch Lasco blade over here. Here it is. See, this is a 9-inch Lasco blade. That's an actual... They're Lakewood blades, apparently. What's the difference? They look identical. I kid you not. But anyway. Yeah. It's a Lakewood. And it's a two-speed. has this convenient carry handle, I guess. But there was many summers I remember this running in the living room window at my grandma's. Been meaning to dig this out for a re-video for a long time. And I'm kind of glad I finally was able to. The back of it has two C-frame motors. They're branded as a Jackal motor. Which is, uh, these little motors are the same thing they used in the 6-inch disc fans. Jackal motors was pretty common on Lakewood fans back in the 90s and 80s, it seems. Uh, there's a model tag right here. It says model T99. I don't know if it'll focus. Can I zoom in? Probably not. Manufactured by Lakewood Engineering and Manufacturing Company, Chicago, Illinois, 60612. 1.5 amps? Is that what this is? I don't know. It's kind of hard to read. So model T99, UL approved. Yeah. I think this is 3.6. I don't know. But anyway. I digress. But anyway, get that out. <laughs> Got the kilowatt meter here, which is reading at 124.4 volts, zero amps. This cord's like really stiff. Anyway, we'll flip her back around here and we'll start her up and do a, the normal demonstration thing here. So here's high. This one motor makes a lot of noise. But yeah, it's really well oiled. It's always made that noise as long as I can remember. It is running at 1.4 amps. So maybe 1.3 was the uh, actual reading. Now, what's the wattage? 78.2.3. And low. This thing moves a lot of air. I'm actually surprised by that. It's probably one of the better twin window fans I own.
<laughs> we'll go to. We are drawing 0.7 amps at 45 watts. Not bad, actually. There's high ahead. This motor makes all the racket, but OWF spills off. You'll see what really confuses me about it. This motor has the better coast down of that one. So I don't know why it makes so much noise. I don't know if it's just that blade's out of balance or what. But I don't know. But geez Louise, it really goes. And I have not serviced this thing in a few years. And it's still got really good coast down. Well, yeah, there you go. There's the Lakewood T99 window fan. I believe this is from the early 90s. Um, hope you enjoyed, and thank you for watching.